What's up, guys? This is Gizmo China. I'm Paco. Uh, earlier today, we joined the Oppo Inno Day 2021, uh, which is an annual event showcasing uh, breakthroughs and reviews uh, across the brand's uh, entire product line. And in the last few years, we've seen some products, some very uh, new products, such as uh, new AR glasses and a very decent rollable concept phone and so on so let's check out what we got today the first product coming out on the event is the Oppo Atlas which is the first existing reality smart glass offering from the brand the glass applies a pretty futuristic design and what really impresses it is the weight it's extremely lightweight, weighing less than 30 grams. It has a single glass design with a micro projector and micro LED, which looks pretty cool at first glance. The glass can deliver up to 1400 nits in brightness, which makes sure that it can work well under different lighting conditions. It's powered by the Snapdragon where 4100 SOC. It features functions like a weather re reminders, schedule reminders, a help app, and a teleprompter, which is useful for speeches and presentations. In addition, you can also use it as a real time translator. Now it supports two way translation between Chinese and English, and the brand promises that Chinese Japanese Chinese Korean translation will be offered in the near future. Its interaction includes touch, voice, hand gesture and head movements like a not a audio shake. But at this point the class is not available for playing video or for gaming. So it probably is designed as a useful expanded reminder for smartwatch and smartphones. The glass is going to launch in first season of next year and by far we have no further information about the pricing. Another important technology revealed on the event is the Mari Silicon X Imaging MPU chipset. The Mari Silicon X MPU was Oppo's first self-designed and self-developed chip manufactured from TSMC 6 nanometer process. Today we experienced it for a while and found that the imaging improvement was pretty impressive. Compared to the sample shot on the Mi 11 Ultra, the portrait image shot on the Oppo phone with the MPU chip is much brighter. It seems to offer powerful AI computing to improve imaging quality. It will enable lossless real-time role captures and maximize the brand's RGBW sensor's performance with extreme dynamic range of 20 bits HDR. And it also make 4K video night mode possible with the powerful AI computing supporting like 4K, 20-bit RAW, AI color, and Ultra HDR at the same time for your mobile video shooting. After seeing the sample shot with the new MPU, we are pretty excited and we are also looking forward to its debut on an available form. And the brand announced that the new chipset will be featured in 2022 5X flagships. So just stay tuned. So that's all we want to share on day one. Tomorrow Oppo is going to launch their new photo flagship phone which was confirmed to be the Oppo 5N. We will bring more information about it tomorrow after the event. Just stay tuned. And don't forget to subscribe to our own channel and new stuff from the tech road are coming soon. Thank you for watching. 
we will see you in the next video.